Hi, I'm Clemmie Telford. I've got a blog called Mother of All Lists and I've also got two boys. And I'm Greg Stanton. I've got a blog called The London Dad and I've got a little boy and a little girl. We are here today to talk to you about car seats. There's just a few things you need to know when you go to purchase yours. If I'm a new parent I'm expecting, what are the key things I need to know? Well, first of all, every car seat that you buy will comply with EU regulations, so they're all pretty safe, which is good. Uh, the one watch out is not to buy a second-hand car seat because you don't know their history. They might have been in a crash, they might not comply to the latest regulations. So the main thing is always buy a brand new car seat. So, Clemmie, what's the deal with front-facing versus rear-facing car seats? There seems to be a lot of confusion about this, but actually rear-facing car seats are much safer. All babies from newborn should be in a rear-facing car seat and stay in them till up to about 15 months or maybe even longer. The other important thing is always read the instructions on your car seat and if you've got any questions, go in store and someone will answer any questions you have. I hear you there. I think but for me as a non-driver, one of the things that we did, we had my mum take us home from the hospital, so we took full advantage of the car seat fitting service um, a couple of months previous to Etta coming and they actually showed us how to fit the car seat properly in my mum's car, nice and easily. Sounds like a smart idea. <laughs> is there anything else in particular that I need to watch out for with car seats? There is actually. There's one thing that we've all been guilty of doing, myself included, is keeping our babies in car seats longer than they should, especially in those first six weeks. Baby should be flat as often as possible. So it's definitely safest to keep baby in car seat when traveling in a car, but the rest of the time, they should be in the carry cot of their pram when they can move around. And as I said, they can be flat. And also you've probably spent quite a lot of money on that carry cot, so it's worth getting your money's worth. 